Okay, so for all you Nerf fans out there, I'm going to show you the most incredible mod you've ever seen, and it's so simple to do. Just as a comparison, here is a Recon CS6, and we're going to load up a single long shot dart. Alright, so here's the long shot single dart in the mag. We're going to put that in. You can see it's already been cocked. And right now we're standing about 25 feet from the target, which is the television screen. So you can see the barrel here and then... Okay, so it goes about 25 feet and it hits about 3 feet below. Hold on. So this is our tricked out modded rocket launcher. I'm going to show you how to make it in a few minutes, but I'm just going to show a demo. We're going to take a regular Nerf dart, just one of the simple suction tip ones, and we're going to put it in the barrel here and then we're going to cock it up. Okay, so we're cocked up now, and this is where we stood before with the CS Recon, and now we're going to back up, oh, let's say another 25 feet or so, and I want you to keep your eye on the television set. So this shot was about 50 feet long. It came from here. Now I'm going to show you what the uh, long shot dart will do. So we've got the long shot dart now in our modded rocket launcher and this is the same distance that we were standing with the recon that landed just in the uh, slate below the TV. Watch the TV. Yeah. Okay, so that's the gun. Okay, so to make this mod you need a couple of things. First of all you need the rocket launcher obviously and what's happened with ours is that the rocket on the rocket launcher has lost a couple of fins. It doesn't work very well but the launcher still works great and we're not going to do anything that changes the rocket launcher. It can always be reverted back to this form. You need one of the bandoleros from the Vulcan or from one of the other Nerf guns that uses them and at the end you're going to take out the two little teeny screws, these two, from the end piece like this and then you take that apart and you see that the webbing here straps into these four pins. All you do is you pull this piece off and then the webbing is exposed. From there, you just take a screwdriver, and on each of these, there's a little part that says Nerf, and you just pop that off with a screwdriver. So I've already taken the end piece off, the part that had the screwdriver that had the plastic covering I've popped off, and you can see where the webbing was stuck to these two little pins. So you slide one of these off, and then you can replace this piece back on the webbing after you've cut it a little bit shorter so it still works fine. So you only lose one shot out of the 25 in your bandolero. Alright, so I put the little piece back on. We can get rid of the bandolero. Now, this piece that had the holding mechanism for the bandolero, it does have an air restriction end, but you can leave that intact. You actually don't need to remove it because it doesn't have the same type of restriction that you would see in the Maverick or some of the other weapons. And what you're going to do is you're going to take duct tape and you're going to abut this next to the end of the rocket launcher, but you're not going to put it directly on the grid. You're going to leave it up about an inch or so. So I'll show you what mine looks like in a sec. I've wrapped this now with the duct tape and you can see that there's about an inch or so from the end. And then we're going to place it inside like this. And you can see there's a piece that you can come down next to. And you're just going to squeeze right around like that. And it'll stay roughly held. It doesn't have to be exact. And then we're going to take another piece of duct tape and just come around the whole item one time. Like that. Now that'll seal your mechanism. But you can see it's fairly flimsy. So we need something to fix that. This is just a standard toilet paper tube. And what I've done is I've put a little bit of duct tape at the ends like this. And we mount this the way you would a suppressor right over the end. It fits perfectly over the barrel. And then you can see at the tip that brings the nozzle right out next to the two pieces and that helps to centralize your shot for accuracy. And that's it. There is your rocket launcher modified to, shy, <coughs> to shoot Nerf darts.